Welcome back to Thunderdog Productions, Episode 7, Mohawk Trailhead Trail and the Goshawk Trail Connector. Goshawk begins and ends around the middle of Mohawk. Here's Goshawk highlighted above, and here's Mohawk highlighted below it. I will show Goshawk with Andy first thing this morning, then I'll come back later and hit Mohawk at full throttle by myself. On to the ride. Nice and rocky. You can go fast, but I'd rather go fast on Mohawk. Goshawk is good to, for the dog. I can go nice and slow. Come on, boy. What's he doing? Did he pick that stick up? Of course. Oh, that's a stick from the other day. Come on, boy. If you really want to see what this, what can be done on this trail. You really gotta check out um, Nate Hill's video when he comes through here. Red Mountain Goat, Alex, um, holy shit, he like hits this thing here and jumps like, he like lands over here somewhere, it's crazy. Come on, boy. So. This is more of a tour guiding video, but the action video, wow, that one is unreal. In fact, if you're willing to put up with this slow video, I will absolutely link Nate's video in my description. Oh boy. All right. You'll see this later when the sun is probably right there. Now we are at the bottom of Goshawk. And that's Goshawk. I did it southbound or downhill predominantly. Next, I came back after lunch and I hit Mohawk from its top or ending down to the trailhead also, technically northbound. It is still the Mohawk intersection. Now this is all Mohawk. And on Strava, it's called 122 turns. Look at how many there are from here to the bottom. Ooh, a lot of pine needles, they're slippery. I'm gonna get the record to that.
and this is the Mohawk Trailhead coming out onto Mohawk Street, located approximately 3800 Mohawk Street in Pine. Parking is along the street. Just make sure you don't block anyone's driveways. Combined with episode six, Toei Trail, you now have two additional ways to access the Pine Strawberry Trail system. These are both dog friendly because they have a lot of shade. If you have a dog like mine, that's definitely a requirement. 